I'm trying, look, this is the thing. I'm trying to see if he has a beef with me, if he has a beef, if he's beefing with me. Do you, are we cool? Guys, believe it or not, today is Friday. Friday, Friday. That we're shooting this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but every day should be Friday. Live every your, day should feel like Friday. Yeah, okay, hold live on. Live your day like it is your last. Y'all, I just, we just, you guys just came up with the title. Treat every day like it's Friday. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You guys are supportive. They didn't like the title. We can change it. No, no, I like it. I think it's yeah. a good thing. Yeah. Guys, it's like, just like be stoked on everything. Exactly. Yeah. Like Friday, we're happy because it's Friday. We're shooting it on a Friday. And we're stoked that Mari's here. Mari's, oh yeah. Yeah. We're Everybody okay. give it up for Mari one time. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Thanks for letting me bust in your show. I like it. Please bust. In my <laughs> show. <laughs> on, uh, on on the, the show. show. <laughs> um, anyways, uh, Mari, would you like to do the first part, which is check out Smosh Art? Sure. And describe this drawing. Let's do it. All right, this is you guys on the log ride in Disneyland by uh, Robin is my name uh, uh, with two E's. Ooh, oh, oh my God. Wait, who's this in the back? That looks I like think me, that's and you. I'm doing SOS. Yeah, that's cute. Good job, oh, Robin. Hey, guys, let's check out some more art. Yes. Yeah. Woo. Look at all this art. Oh, oh I love that one. That's nice, that's nice. You guys are so talented. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, uh, so we asked you guys to ask us some questions under the hashtag Ask Smosh. Yep. And uh, let's see what our first question is. Okay, so at Tori, how do you say that? At Terry. T ter Terry So. <laughs> Terry So. I told y'all I can't read. <laughs> Tori. Like, We're still learning our vowels. It's straight okay. Up, it's all right. I got, we'll I'm get telling there you. Soon. I'm telling you, it's not a joke. <laughs> so at Smosh, what is a crazy fightish with a customer or an employee? All right. <laughs> you make them look dumb. What? What are you? I'm making myself look dumb. <laughs> not what them. is? What is a crazy fightish? Ish, like a fight, but kind of with a customer an or an argument? employer, yeah, okay. or an employer you had in any of your previous or current jobs. I just we love, love each fights. other so much. No, no I okay. Love can I just fights. talk about how, like, our producer right here? I don't even remember his name. His name's like Joshua or something, Mattingly. Um, he's <laughs> really mean to me day in and day out. He gives me hugs, but at the same time, like it's kind of, I don't know, like one day he's like, Keith, I love you, you're my favorite. And then uh, like in front of everyone, he's like, yeah, dude, I hate you. Bye. Do you want to talk about how you feel about me? Because we can squash this right now, Jerry Springer stuff. I was just watching Jerry Springer on Facebook. You, come on, come on, get in here, please. Gonna... Come on, come sit down, please. I didn't even know there was this beat. <laughs> Did you just see that? Don't see that? What? Wow, you're a large man. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. What is Are this you beat? Producer? Did uh, yeah. you just make up this beat? No, just so we had a no. story. <laughs> he hates on me. He freaking hates Jeez, on me all the time. That's not true. Did you guys just see his fist when he came and sat down? He said, well, I'm holding me. I'm holding a memory card. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, now, right. like, please Probably. rewind the tape. <laughs> see what I'm talking about? No, I don't look, know. listen, okay, to squash it for real, that's not, there's nothing, nothing. There's no beef. I don't believe you. Why? It, because you just like stuttered a hundred times. <laughs> I can't, I can't Wait, is there really beef? Yeah, oh my so God, you're lying. There's, really beef. there's, there's not tell, really I beef. I can't tell if there's beef. Yeah, I can't tell. Is there beef? I'm trying, look, this is the thing. I'm trying to see if he has a beef with me, if he has a beef, if he's beefing with me. Do you, are we cool? No, it's not the case. We <laughs> joke around all the time and nobody actually knows how to take it, yeah. which is kind of my favorite thing. Mm -hmm. that's what Every I like. day we come to the office. Yeah, I mean, it's, no, not I real. it's not it's real. real it's not real. Well, that's <laughs> <laughs> No, I love Joshua. Mr. Magley. Uh, let's maybe not talk about our current jobs. So I never had beef at my jobs, but I, I was a customer. And this one time, this girl, for whatever reason, didn't like me. She was working at a smoothie shop, and so she was behind like the smoothie place. I was a customer just trying to get like a smoothie, and she was like, I'm gonna beat you, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, ah, I don't know what to do yeah. in this situation. Like, <laughs> you know, hold on, you know what to you. do when that happens? Just ask them what are what, what are, are you, you doing? doing? <laughs> yeah. I, I, I think I just walked away, but I kind of yeah. felt sorry I mean, for her. honestly, yeah. with a comment like that, you should just walk away. Yeah. Because <laughs> she's ready. Like, you can't win with that. Like, no. <laughs> you can't win with crazy. Yeah. This one is at I Eat Souls Buddy. 
Could you tell us the weirdest, creepiest dream you ever had that you can remember? Okay, these questions are starting to become a little too much. <laughs> yeah, this could <laughs> get real dark <laughs> This could get dark and nasty. Okay, so for me, um, it was crazy because Michael Jackson was like in like the zombie, like the green, like thriller, like whatever he had on his red, but he was with all his ghouls and goblins and everything. And they were like, just like walking after me. It wasn't a recurring dream. It just happened like once when I was younger, before uh -huh. I really got into like Michael like the way I am now, mm -hmm. but definitely was a fan, but also really, really afraid of Thriller. So now I'm just wondering like what I'm running from. What's your creepy <laughs> weird dream? Um, when I was a kid, I used to get uh, night terrors. And uh. so like my body would uh. like, freeze up and I used to get really, really scared. I watched uh, the Fre Freddy Krueger series like no. way too early in life, way too early because my brother's 10 years older than me. It was, I think when I was about 10, I started lucid dreaming, which means that I can like control my dreams. How do you do that? Where uh, you learn that at? I think, it, I, I think because it, I was up. so scared. And so wow. that was the first time that I was able to like flip it around and Freddie and I became friends. What? And we were going down a, like a giant uh, river of blood in a cave. And oh we my were in God. a canoe. He and I went on a killing spree in my dream. Mari, I look at you. Mari has the, one of the biggest <laughs> hearts like here at the Smosh, whatever you want to call this, whatever. Oh my like God. in life, one of the, like, the nicest, most beautiful, gentle souls I've ever encountered. This story makes me look at you completely different. Keith, I, I have two sides to me. Yes. That's like, <laughs> <laughs> oh that's, my God. That's the underside. She, oh, she it was the best. Hard. Freddy Krueger kill people. Oh, mine. Um, these I have definitely weird, creepy dreams because I'm a weird person. Yes. But uh, mm -hmm. what what yes. always confirms. like freaks yes. me out is weirdness confirmed. I, I like sometimes I, I I have sleep paralysis and it's super. Oh, annoying. I hate that. I hate and that. And I get it a lot when I take naps. Like I get in the office too. Oh my god. You take them. You get those. You like, get them here. Yeah. yeah. That like, sucks. I'll like I'll be like ugh, and then I'd like be able to like open my eyes and I could see like people but you walking can't move. and I can't move and I just go back into it and I'm like okay this time I'm gonna fully wake up. You just gotta go back to sleep at that point. I know, but it's it so hard, but it's like your mind is like, you need to drink more water. Next! <laughs> Next question. <laughs> At Lil Pap2 asks Pap. if you had the ability to destroy any fast food company, which one? And how would you destroy it? Um, wait, why would we food. destroy any fast food company? I mean, because yeah. it is ruining a lot of yeah. people's health. I guess I would like buy like a McDonald's franchise and then ruin like Burger King or something. <laughs> there you yeah. go. I hear but you. But it would only just be like to for me to profit. <laughs> Like, I used to have a big addiction to Chipotle. Like, I, like, had an addiction to it. I don't want to say I will destroy it, but I will definitely destroy a bowl right now if somebody <laughs> put it in my face. Yes! Because I want that mom and dad. Y'all still great. mad because I got love for Chipotle. Uh, Chipotle, I'm here. Bowl! I feel like everyone's trying to be better now with their menus. Like, it's healthier. I mean, like, no, not really. Like, there's some... They're, they're going for it. I just think, I, wouldn't just, I would just want these companies, if they set the standard higher, mm -hmm. then they can really make the rest of the American people healthier too, because they, I know in LA, it's not really predominantly, we don't really eat fast food that much because everyone's super healthy here. Speak but for like, yourself. I think McDonald's has like the, the healthier option stuff too. I'm gonna change my answer. I'm gonna say whichever franchise it, like does the worst to the environment, mm -hmm. that one's the one yeah. that's gonna go down. Yeah, I'll give you yeah. that. Yeah. Save our planet. We're at the segment where Smosh asks you, and we ask you a question, you guys answer it. All right, okay, so we asked you guys, would you rather take perfect selfies always, but look terrible in any other photos, or always look amazing in tagged photos, but terrible in your own profile pics? Me personally, I would like to look good in all my selfies, and then, because all the tag photos, I can remove. <laughs> from my life. And untag. You mm. untag me. And so. pretend like that was not you. Exactly. Like the Emperor shows you. No, it's not. No, that's, that's not, not me. with me. It's not tags. It's not <laughs> no, tags. No, so you're wrong. It's not me. It's like, oh, let's look at Keith's tagged photos. Zero, Zero. photos. <laughs> Nobody likes taking photos with Keith for some reason. Yep. <laughs> okay, so this is an answer from at Damien Smunge. Mm -hmm. Damien's Munge. I'd rather look amazing in tagged photos and bad in profile photos because I usually have Damien as my profile pic and he always looks freaking gorgeous, so there's no problem. There you go. <laughs> Just have somebody else in your profile pic. <laughs> like I have Katie Holmes as my profile pic. And <laughs> Do fine. you? No. Oh, I was about to say, you did have some Mine weird is a sloth. Though. Yeah, yours is weird. Mine's always weird, I don't care. 
He's <laughs> um, weird. I'm do you sorry. want to read this next answer? <laughs> sure. At I am on top with two P's. Hmm? Shane said, top. Said, <laughs> look amazing in tagged photos because the only place I use my own pictures for my profile pic is Facebook and I'm never on there anyway. Mm. So at Smashy, Smashy Julia, Julia says, said, I would, I would rather, rather always, always look, look amazing, amazing in tagged photos, photos so, so it would always, always look like I have friends and stop making selfies. Aww. Aww. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I didn't Keith, know that's what... how you're gonna look like. You have no friends because you have zero <laughs> tagged photos. Oh my god! <laughs> Marty's so mean! <laughs> 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 I said the most nice things about you earlier, and Marty's just like been like boom, boom, boom. You're so sensitive. I am, you gotta you understand. You gotta talk about the sensitivity, Listen, Keith. okay, let me, okay, honestly, so I don't read that well. I'm trying to let Mari know this. So Mari, I don't read that well, and I just got through reading, and you like, I was proud of myself. Yeah, you didn't clap oh, for yeah. me. Mm -hmm. oh. So. <laughs> I got to clap for Keith's clap. reading. Thank Guys, God, actually, let's rename this show to Let's Clap for <laughs> Keith's Reading. Clap for Keith's Reading? I'm down with that. Yeah. I was getting better. You, Thank you. See, uh, Josh loves me. That's well, he just, that Josh just told me that he, he was kidding. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to go beat up our producer. Um, and by beat up, you mean just cry in his face. <laughs> no, by beat up, meaning going into her lucid dream and asking Freddie to <laughs> kill, kill Because kill Freddie's, he's very busy. He has other oh, people yeah. he needs to murder. Damn it. Um, guys, this was really awesome, Mari. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, yeah. Thanks for coming and hanging out with us. Thanks for this. having me on. I always like coming on this show. Yeah, guys, please comment in the comment section on like what other people you would like to see on the show like in Smosh Games, because I, they've all been on the show, but I'm we'd like sure. to see them more because it's really fun like, you know, hanging out. forces. Yeah. Uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for um, watching this and comment down below what other stuff we should incorporate in the show because we like doing like special things. Yeah. To like, you know, connect with y'all. Yeah, we so, love y'all. Yeah. Thanks guys. Bye. 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 Thanks for watching. Check back next week for more. In the meantime, click on the box things to watch other fun stuff.